All right, we're back out here in a cotton field in western Oklahoma and near Hydro, Oklahoma. We're still looking at cotton, and we've dug up some plants that had a nematicide on it, along with levisol. And so we're going to compare with and without. Right now, it doesn't look like we're seeing much nematode activity. I'll turn this around and show you these roots. Here are the roots of a untreated and that plant looks very healthy and so we look at that let's try it from another angle just just in case you see that and then let's set the treated one Not wanting to cooperate here. Alright. Treated on the top. Untreated on the bottom. Not a whole lot of difference. You see a fair amount of difference in these plants anyway in the field at this time. In the stage of the growth and everything. So there you can see top is treated, bottom is untreated. A um, little bit of difference, but no no signs of nematodes on either one. So I think right now we're still uh, in the uh, observation mode to determine if we're even going to have a nematode uh, count to be able to compare against. This year has also been a wet year, so you can see that uh, the field is clean and growing extremely well as we pan around the field here there's about 300 or excuse me 120 acres and this is looking to the west um, this field's been in cotton a number of years does extremely well and we'll come back and we'll we'll take some counts some bowl counts once they've cracked open It'll probably be in late October. Won't probably be quite as hot, or it could be. Uh, we're hoping. And we're hoping for a late frost, and that'll help us to make a few extra bowls on these blooms and top growth that hasn't bloomed yet. We mentioned earlier about September 5th, somewhere in there to the 10th, depending on what the weather does, will depend on how late some of these blooms will make. This cotton looks really good overall. He's done a great job. And then we'll be able to look at some uh, yield maps once uh, the cotton has cracked and opened and see if we can see some differences there between levisol and no levisol and then also with the nematicide and without nematicide. We also had a little bit of unlocked in here with the uh, um, levisol so that seemed to give it a little bit of a boost early on and we'll just continue to watch this and have another follow-up uh, here in the next 30 45 days